Anybody today? Think, oh, you're thinking, you're thinking about stabbing me? I gotta go. How the hell could you sleep with all this madness going on? My baby just paid for us to meet Freddy. How excited are you? Bobby freaking England. Which is who? Freddy Krueger. See, so this is why Freddy doesn't do movies anymore. They just lie to people where they meet this guy. So I was gonna sneak in the other line. This one starts yelling about it. Puts me on blast. Bro, I'm the only person that got to strangle Freddy. My girlfriend finally got her dream come true when she got to meet Freddy Krueger. Show him the picture! And I got to strangle him. Baby bought me some food, thank you, and a beer. A Freddy beer. Uh, it's just Mikey walking through the crowd with his knife out. Totally normal. Nothing to see here. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's great. They still have to do the color in his face. Is it him and then the jumping yeah, out. Yeah, he's like, that's that's like, it's like coming right out. Oh my god. Fire. Yeah. They say yeah, if your girlfriend's it. obsessed with Michael Myers, it means she wants to oh, yeah. stab yeah, you. Yeah, I took him. I got Send him. Send help. I love these actions. Freddy! Hey! <laughs> So I'm here with Mike Aloisi. This guy is an author of some really, really dope books. This is, um, tell me tell about this, how you were just telling me about this. So that's Steve Gonzalez from uh, Ghost Hunters, and it's a book that showcases a lot of his favorite haunted locations in the world. Which is Taps out of Rhode Island, right? Yep. All right, good, good. And now this one right here. This is Kane Hodder, who played Jason in four of the Friday 13th movies. Uh, that is his official biography. Now, what, what was he like? As a, So you obviously did it with him. What was he like as a guy? Uh, he is crazy and fun. Oh. So that's why we have so much stuff, because he got me in so many adventures. Um, as we're writing the book, that I wrote a blog about it, which turned Ooh. into a book, which turned into a reality show together, oh. and then a sequel. So that's how much adventures he, him and I have. Yeah. Now, what about these ones down here? So these are my gory short story collections. Uh, about 15 to 20 short stories in each one, all creepy tales. Nice. Out of all these, what, what would you say is your favorite favorite one to do? Was it uh, this one or this one? Uh, this one's my favorite for now, yep. only because um, it's been out for a long time. It took me on a book tour all over the world. Um, and we've actually had people who sent us letters saying that the book saved their lives, which was really? pretty, yeah, pretty amazing. Yeah, so. yep. And this one just came out two weeks ago, so. Oh, wow. It. Yeah, so I can't, I don't have the favoritism yet. No, anyone that's anyone that's watching, where can they get these books? Uh, they're available everywhere in the world. 
Um, but authormike.com is my website. Authormike.com? Authormike.com, yep. Okay, do you have an Instagram? Uh, yes. You do, you know it. Uh, it's like author Mike. I don't know. I suck at social media. I do TikTok every day, though. What's your TikTok? Say uh, it's uh, a... uh, Mike Aloisi, author Mike. You can look, search for either or. All right, make sure you follow him and check out his books. They look really dope. All right, this is my first vlog ever in her first vlog ever. Obviously, we're the Terracon. We're going to keep showing you everything here. Make sure you like and subscribe and comment. You want that shit to give away many things. And G-Mon. I'm here with Sandy Johnson, a.k.a. Michael Myers' first kill. Michael! How does it feel to be the first kill that started this? Do you think that it would turn into this phenomenon that it is there? Uh, um, it's pretty amazing. Who knew that this would happen, but I'm delighted that I get to meet Keith Myers and his first kill. Yeah. yeah. Now, what do you think of um the, the newer ones? Uh, I liked 2018 the best. Yeah. Uh, there was a lot of stuff in 2018 that I liked. After that, not so much. Um, I did like the uh, fireman opening scene. I think that was in Kills. It opens with the yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I like the opening scene in that one. I liked a lot of things in 2018 and not much in the last one. Now, what are, what are some other things that you've done that people can check out? Uh, I have done Gas Pump Girls, Hot, uh, Jokes My Post Never Told Me. I just did a voiceover in a film called Pyridolia that premiered in London last weekend. Yay! Yeah. And I'm shooting another film uh, next month in Florida called The Executioner, where I'm a psychiatrist. It's a nice role. So that's kind of what I'm up to. I'm also going to be in a, several other cons this year, A25, Scuba in Florida, Nightmare in the Falls, uh, Scarefest in Kentucky. Nice. Nice. All right. Well, you guys make sure you check her out on all that. And thank you for being Mike's first kill. You did a great job getting killed. Thank you. <laughs> What's up, guys? How you doing? You having a good time at Terra Terracon? Yeah. All right. You guys a little crazy or what? <laughs> what do you What do you got there? You looking for our autographs? Oh, you got. Oh. oh, you want my autograph? All right. Awesome. This is the world famous G Money. You know G Money? Can you talk? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wait, did we just sign our souls to the devil? The oh. oh, I got you. This will be on a vlog. Nice. Hey, make sure you follow her. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. I'm here with Dave Daniel. Right, this guy makes, what would you call it? Gra graphic novels, right? Yeah, just came out with a graphic novel, Hard Kill Harry. It's kind of like... Uh, Calvin and Hobbes and oh, yeah. Meets Fight Club. Yeah, Meets Fight Club and Looney Tunes. Nice. And uh, I did all the writing, I did all the art, hand lettered it. The only thing I didn't do is the cover, which is done by Simon Bisley. Now, if you had to say, how long did this take you to do, bro? You did the whole thing? It took about a year to do. When COVID hit in 2020, I started writing, got all the writing done, and then I did all the art and got all the stuff printed by last year. So. About oh. two years, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Oh, check this guy out. All right, I'm here with my man. What's your name? Corey. You got the sweetest stash I've ever seen, dude. That. How many chicks do you get with a stash like um, that? Um, I just got one, my girlfriend. That's, that's did she ask you to keep grow it? it? She did not, but... She and is, she's still she, with she you? She let me keep it. She let me keep it, yeah. She's like on the verge of breaking up with you. Yo, though. Come on. 
Wow, tell, tell, tell all these guys what you guys got here. All right, so uh, Copper Coast Infections, we got gourmet fudge uh, based on uh, characters, some of them. We got our classic ones down here too. Uh, we got all our hand-painted truffles. Um, Who's this girl right there? We got D over here. She's Where's she our, from? Where's she from? Boston in the house, and where you're from? Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. But he said it's called Picks. Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh. Now these guys go all across the country, right? So you're gonna be in Rhode Island soon, right? For the yeah. Rhode Island Comic Con. Tell them where they can. Uh, yep. We'll have two locations there. Uh, and tell them what they can expect. What's the, what's that? What's that gonna happen? We got everything pop culture. I mean, movies, shows. In sync. Will In Sync be there? Um, I know I've that's seen, your favorite group. I've seen a couple of the members actually before. Yeah. Really? Joey Fatone. I've oh, seen. Shoot. Yeah. Yeah, um, but yeah, any celebrities you want to see, um, movies, video games, art, pop culture, it's nice. really something for everybody. Hell yeah. Now tell everyone about what you got here. All right, we got, I think we have 18 flavors of gourmet fudge with us today. Um, we do samples. Um, we got some that are fruity, some that are chocolatey, some that are classics. Where's the ones with weed in them? Not here yet, not here yet. But they're coming? I can't promise anything. Hey, listen, you're in Massachusetts. You can do it. Right. <laughs> maybe, maybe next time. Maybe next time. All right. All right. So just tell everyone where, where to check you out the uh, right. the event. So Rhode Island Comic Con, November third through fifth. Check us out on our website. Uh, Ten percent off there. Um, and some more info on the back for you. All right. Make sure you check them out. It's gotta be the only place in the world you can walk around in these crazy costumes and look normal. Jason. Making a vlog and I'm asking everyone if they still date you. If they date me? Yeah. They better. I have a magical box. Everybody loves my box. <laughs> See everyone walking around here, even the devil. What the hell? Ma'am, you have a Freddy arm coming out of you. Alright, so that was it. That was the Terracon 2023. What did you think? This is G Money, by the way. G Money, what did you do? It was amazing. Got to meet Bobby England, Heather Langenkamp, Daniel Harris. It was awesome. What was it like meeting, meeting Freddie? Oh my God, he is such a down to earth, funny, cool guy. Uh, we walked in there to do our photo shoot and he said, uh, pretend like I'm taking her to the prom and you're real angry about it. So we'll and then what happened? What did I do to Freddy? You choked Freddy in the neck. I choked him. Make sure you subscribe. <laughs>